Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm Zeke, and welcome to the Dream Green Show. As 2021 starts, there are a lot of new investors out there looking for ways to invest their money with the opportunity to make money. There are a lot of applications out there and a lot of questions for new investors to ask. In this episode, we're gonna talk about Acorns. So this is gonna be a complete beginner guide. I'm gonna answer, how do you make money? Can you lose money? What do they invest into? And I'm gonna give you all the pros and cons. So make sure that you guys hit the thumbs up button before we dive into this video. It helps out this channel more than you can even imagine. So with that being said, this video is brought to you by Weeble. Sign up now by clicking the link down in the description, depositing $100, and now you can receive four free stocks valued up to $1,600 each. With those four free stocks, you could keep them inside the platform and decide to use it, or you could sell those four free stocks and withdraw all of your money. It's literally free money. Another link down in the description is Coinbase. That is by far the easiest way to buy and sell cryptocurrency like Bitcoin. So if you guys wanna pick up some cryptocurrencies, those links are down in the description. But enough talking, let's go ahead and dive straight into this video. Welcome back dreamers. Here we are on my Acorns account. I'm gonna go over my account right quick and then we're gonna dive into all of the new questions that you guys have. And, and if this will be a platform, you will be interested into investing in in the future. Right now, my account is at $4,689.77. So far, I've withdrawn twice from Acorns. Each time I withdraw $1,000. So really, I should have around $6,000 inside this account. I'll tell you why I withdraw $1,000 from my account. It only takes about two days to get your money, but I'm gonna tell you why towards the end of this video, so make sure that you stick through the end. All right, so my portfolio settings is on aggressive, I have my roundup settings on automatic times two, and I invest $10 every single Friday. So this is my portfolio. If I scroll down to my performance, over the last year alone, I am up $1,130.07. I am up 19.5%. So that is my account. Now let's get into all of the questions that you guys are probably running about. Okay, the first question is how does Acorns work? Acorns take your roundups that you have linked your card to your account. Let's say if you go to the grocery store and bought something for a dollar and 50 cents, it's gonna round it up to the nearest dollar, which is $2. So it's gonna take that 50 cents and invest it into the stock market for you. So it's gonna take your roundups Anytime that you swipe your card, round it up to the nearest dollars and take your pocket change and invest it into the stock market. With my pocket change alone, I was able to make over a thousand dollars profit this year from just my pocket change. So that's basically how Acorns work. It takes every time that you swipe your card, it rounds it up to the nearest dollar and then invest it into the stock market. Now, once you have set up your parameters, you can have your portfolio on five different settings. You can have it on conservative, where it invests into ultra short-term government bonds and short-term government bonds. You could have it on moderately conservative, where it invests into medium company stocks, international company stocks, short-term bonds, US bonds, and large company stocks. You could have it on moderate, it invests into large company stocks, medium company stocks, small company stocks, international company stocks, short-term bonds, and US bonds. You can have it on Marley Aggressive. They invest 47% into large company stocks, 6% into medium company stocks, 3% into small company stocks, 24% into international company stocks, 6% um, into short-term bonds, and 14% into US bonds. Our Aggressive, which is my portfolio, 55% into large company stocks, 10% into mini medium company stocks, 5% into small company stocks, and 30% into international company stocks. Other ways to invest is that on your roundup settings, I have mines on times two. So other than me buying something for $1.50 and it rounds up to the nearest dollar, which is $2, so that's 50 cents difference. I have mines on times two, so I multiply that 50 cents times two and invest a dollar into the stock market for me. So every time I go to the store and buy Red Bull, it's gonna take that roundup, multiply it by two and invest into the stock market, which eventually is gonna make me even more money to buy more Red Bull in the future. Um, and another way is your reincurring. You can have your reincurring value set up right here. I have mines on $10 every single Friday. You can set it up how any way that you want. 
I know people that invest $100 every Friday and it works just as well. So that is basically how Acorns work. It takes your money and invest this for you and it takes your roundups and invest it for you. And it's pretty much set and forget and you just check on it every now and then whenever you feel like it. The next question is, can you lose money by using Acorns? Well, the, with any investment, yes, you can lose money, but they are so conservative. They're so safe with their investments that eventually over time, historically shown through stats that what they invest into, you should make money every single year. Now, if you started investing right here, right before the pandemic happened, of course, if you start investing right there, the whole world had a pullback due to the pandemic and the entire world being shut down. So that's when the market eventually had dropped and a lot of people that just started using Acorns eventually started to lose money as they first started to invest into this platform. But as you guys can see, it eventually recovered and it's up 19.5%. Now the S&P 500, which is the, the stock market pretty much, usually goes up anywhere from six to 8% every single year over the last 30 years. Now, me being up 19.5% in a single year, Acorns had did a pretty good job investing my money. I'm satisfied with their investments this year and I'm going to continue to use this platform. So yes, you can, you, you can lose money, but so far I've been making money every single year using this platform. Question number three, what do they invest into? So when you, when you, when they're taking your roundups and investing your money into the stock market, what invest, what exactly are they investing into? So we go right here to the account breakdown and click on large company stocks right there at the top. It says it right there. They're investing into VOO. VOO is an ETF. And since this is a beginner's guide, you guys probably don't know what an ETF is. Well, VOO is an ETF. It is a company that has a bunch of other companies inside of their portfolio. So it's not just one company. So they have, so here you go. They'll have companies like Microsoft, Apple, Amazon, Facebook, Google Class C, Google Class A. They have all of these companies inside of their portfolio. I think VOO has over, 500 different companies inside of their portfolio. So it tracks 500 different large cap companies that usually does well. So let's just say Apple has an amazing year, Google has an amazing year, but Facebook have a bad year. Those two companies right there will offset Facebook bad year. So it's not like you're investing all of your money into Facebook and then has a bad year and you'll lose money on Acorn because they're investing into VOO, which is an ETFs that have 500 different companies inside of their portfolio. Usually these large cap companies carry the weight of each other to where they, they're, they have a percentage gain of around six to 8% every single year. So it's a super safe investment investing into this ETF VOO. That is the main one for um, aggressive portfolio. If we take a look at medium cap companies, this one invests into these six companies right here i really like etsy if we go down to the small cap companies right here these are the six that these small cap companies come into you probably you probably will recognize Wingstop. and if we go to the international companies a great one is alibaba tencent nestle uh samsung these are all great companies so that's why i have my portfolio on aggressive but this is another etf ixus it's not exactly investing into alibaba or Nestil or Tencent Holdings. It's in this ETF IXUX is a, a international ETF that has a bunch of different companies inside of their portfolio as well. So that's what they do with your roundups. They're not buying individual stocks. They're buying ETFs that have a bunch of different companies inside of their portfolio, which makes it a safe investment for you to grow your money. All right, and that leads us to our last question. What are the pros and cons? The pros, you guys already know the pros. It is very simple. You, you link your card and you set your settings and you pretty much forget about it. You could go through your everyday life swiping your card, knowing that every time you spend some money, that a little bit of that money is getting reinvestment. And, and all of that small change eventually adds up into a very large investment with, in a very short time in a very short time. So you guys are actually making money when you spend money. And this app is very simple to use. You can set it up and forget it. Now, when it comes to the cons, who we? Now, I have my account set on aggressive. The only con that I could think about with Acorns is that it's not aggressive enough. To me, investing into only ETFs is super 
conservative it's safe it's not aggressive at all it is too safe for me it's not aggressive enough for me but this app keeps me humble it keeps me i need safe investments but i wish that they had one more setting to where that could be another setting maybe called super aggressive to where they're actually investing and trading individual stocks but this aggressive stock is actually so it's, it's safe it's not aggressive at all i don't know why it's called aggressive uh, for I guess for new newbies, for new people, this might seem aggressive, but to me, this is not aggressive at all. Not even close to being aggressive. I would call this super safe. So if you're setting up your portfolio, to me, their aggressive setting is safe. Don't I would not go with conservative. That is too safe. I don't even think you you will make any money that way. I would have it set on aggressive. It's already safe. Their aggressive setting is already safe. That is my one con with Acorns is that. I wish they had another setting that was much more aggressive, which leads me to what I told you guys earlier of me withdrawing $2,000 out of Acorns. I ended up withdrawing $2,000 out of Acorns to invest in two different companies myself over on my Robinhood account. Uh, I withdraw out $2,000 and I bought some Tesla stock with it and I made a lot more money investing into, into Tesla with my individual money than I would have kept it in here investing into ETFs. But this um, Acorns app is set and forget. You set and you forget it. It's an amazing way. The only con to this app is that it's just not aggressive enough for me. But for you newbie investors out there, this might be the perfect app for you until you get the hang of it. So there we go, dreamers. That is my Acorns account. I gave you guys, uh, how do you make money? How does it work? Can you lose money? What are the pros and cons? Let me know down in the comment section if you're gonna end up using Acorns in 2021. This might be a great year for investing into the stock market. And if you don't know anything about the stock market, <laughs> this might be the perfect app for you if you're looking to make passive income. But if you want to see more videos about investing and you're interested into investing into the stock market yourself, make sure that you subscribe to this channel so you don't miss out on any future videos. But other than that, I'm Zeke, bringing you the Dream Green Show, and I'm out. Peace.